the appetite for more buildings never ends. And I think we've got to, and I guess I feel as governor, I have an obligation to protect the interests of the taxpayers. And I put together a five-year projection budget, and I want to make sure that we have the money to pay for education reform and property tax relief that we approve this year, because the costs of that are going to be up in, in future years. And I want to make sure that we meet our obligations before we embark on additional spending. I, it, I'm certainly not against it. Even at the University of Iowa, we built a new law school and, and a lot of other buildings. So, uh, and it, and it, obviously at Iowa State, we did a lot in the biomedical research in those areas. But I, I do think we've got to be really cautious about the debt load that uh, that we're putting on with these bond projects. And I would prefer to try to do more of it on a pay-as-you-go basis so you don't have to pay the interest as well. When it comes to research facilities, which was once again another part of the um, University of Iowa and Iowa State's new buildings, how does research fit into those future? Research is really important. Uh, when I first became governor, I suggested that we ought to have um, research parks in conjunction with the universities. Mm -hmm. At that time, um, I had significant resistance from the president of Iowa State, which was Bob Parks. Uh, but then along came Gordon Neaton with a new attitude, and we built the research park. And now, under your new president, uh, Stephen Leith, uh, he's very, and of course, he comes from a research background. And that's one of the reasons why I was, and, and I was just up there for web filings and see their new building in the research park. And they're, that's the first phase, they've got another one going. Um, under construction already. And uh, they have $12 million, uh, I think, really unique idea for expanding that research park. So I think research makes a lot of sense, both basic research that occurs on the universities, but also the applied research that goes. University of Iowa also has uh, uh, the um, Oakdale campus with significant research uh, park as well. And the research park, um, I know it was mentioned that there's quite a bit of economic benefit when it comes to that. Will these buildings have a greater chance of getting approval when it comes to budgets if they show that they have an economic Absolutely. benefit to the state? Absolutely. Absolutely. And, and this has been my contention from the day I took office. The universities can play a very key role in growing the Iowa economy. Iowa State in particular because it's agriculture and engineering and biosciences is where the real growth is today. And, and so what I really try to do is look at things from a more of a long-term perspective, want to make sure that the state is in the financial position we can afford to do what we're going to do. And, and certainly, obviously, when we're looking at biosciences, that's an area you want to invest. But I also want to make sure that we're doing it in the most fiscally responsible way possible, too.